yeah, we want people to have a good day. We want the loyal orders to enjoy their day, and we also want those people who have a different view and want to express their protest to do so. But this all needs to be done lawfully and peacefully, and we're satisfied that there's a good tone set for the day. The build-up to this with other recent significant events has been very positive. Communities have been engaged with each other in many instances and certainly have been engaging very constructively with the police and I want to give them credit for that. Well, we don't want to do anything in the police that's going to escalate tension, but let me say that through our training, through how we're equipped, through the the, uh, the plans that we've been putting, putting in place over many weeks, we're not taking anything for granted. Uh, I suppose we're we're ready to police with uh, an escalation and tension uh, if that occurs, but actually we don't want to do anything to create that. So. Uh, we've got great officers here who have been doing this for many years, who know what they're about, who have got relationships with local communities. We want to use those sort of tools to keep tension as low as possible and to allow everyone to exercise their rights today. Well, I'm glad the prayer went down. Uh, it was a peaceful uh, protest. Um, last night, I think, is probably the quietest 11 that I can remember, at least in many, many a year. I'm happy that we are where we are, and uh, I hope that the, the, the rest of the day will go off very quietly. Um, and I think it's the first 11 night in the 12th I was able to go to bed at 1 o'clock in the morning. It was just, uh, it was nothing happened. So, if, if that's the way we can continue on, then we're doing very well. Uh, recently, the residents and the Orange were quite close to uh, a resolution of this very long-running uh, um, issue around uh, parades and uh, protests, and I hope that that can be returned to in, in the near future. We do not want, certainly I don't want to be standing here in the next uh, five years, and I don't want the next generation to be going through any tension around um, the, the parading season. I mean, that's what it's down to. So, I mean, as I'm standing here this morning, I'm, I'm quite happy.